Hello, hello, Space Adventurers. Welcome back to the channel. Dimper here. And I'm super, super excited. Today we'll be kicking off a new series. And this will be a no death run, right? So if we die, we restart from zero. And given that how I like to run on very low health, that is more than likely it's going to happen sooner rather than later. So. This is our character here. So this is technically our first but second episode because the first episode was titled The Guide. We essentially done one facility and we already got a Sentinel Superior <laughs> armor there. We have some really, really solid weapons here. So we got some really good weapons. We got a Max Shot. Um, we got a Legendary Solist. We got a Refined Max She, Lacerate Big Bang. So we have some decent, decent equipment, but this is the the crown jewel in the correction this gun will carry us so this is an advanced maelstrom semi-automatic armor piercing scope tactical grip right um and of course we have this ship that we got like level six or something so pretty pretty decent so far we're going good this ship has decent cargo so what's the cargo on at the moment so it's got about 2.3k cargo so we're doing good um so today's episode is basically going to a facility try and become better and then we also might and do the uh, first quest of the uc fleet eventually just to get the ship weapons so whether we die in space or whether we die on the planet if we die that is it the series ends right then and there every episode however so let's just set the guidelines here no death no vendors which means i can't purchase weapons ammo or meds um no no safe scamming so we cannot safe scam. We start now, clean slate. No safe scamming, we start from zero. Um, I safe scammed in the guide because I wasn't sure if I want to go down the safe scamming or non safe scamming. So no death, no safe scamming, no vendors. Okay, that's the ground rules. And every episode, you guys get to determine the challenge. So write in the comment section what you want to see, what sort of a challenge you want to see in this series. And every episode will do a complete challenge. So one, could be pistols only, one could be no meds, just rested beds. Um, that would be really hard, by the way. Um, so any, 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 anything you guys want, I'm game. You let me know, I'll do it for you. Um, and then guys, once we hit 6k subscribers, if we hit 6k, 6K subscribers, I'll do a one-off uh, live stream where you guys can join me and uh, ask me questions. Given the majority of my audience in the States, uh, I'll try and do it on like a Friday night. Friday night, United States time, probably AM for me. Anyway, so let's carry on. We got a facility here. Looks like a radio station. I could be wrong. Doesn't look like any radio station I've seen. Let's go in. I could be wrong, guys. This, this, that might not be an antenna. It looks a bit different. Oh, no, no. It looks about the same. Sorry, it wasn't rendered. But it's got some weird growth on it. What the heck is that? What in the world? Guys, 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 what is this thing? What the heck is this thing? It looks evil. <laughs> it looks like something corrupted the, the tower here. Alright, never mind, we'll carry on. What do we have here? Weapon case. Arc welder. I, I suppose we'll take it. What's our weight at the moment? 98 out of 135, so. Navigator. Ooh. What do we have here? Hey, I want to show you I show, I want to show you guys something. Oh, no, actually, we, we can't do it here. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. I'll, I'll, I'll do it in another video. Um, okay, I'm just going to drop that. Weapon workbench. I don't want to upgrade anything just yet. Let's look around. I'm curious to see. What? In the world is this? This looks like something out of Dead Space. 
sure you guys have played Dead Space. Yeah, this looks like something out of Dead Space. Oops, missed my cue there. Give me a second. Give me a um second, ladies and gentlemen. Some more damage. I'm beginning to actually enjoy this game more and more. Like all this stuff that I've not seen before. What is this? Ah, oh, max pressure. Okay. Let's go inside here, see if there's any survivors. Knock, knock. Anybody here? It does not seem like it. Either way, I'm just gonna rest. Just for an hour. Quick save there. Nothing of interest. Some injector. We'll take it. So meds are gonna be tight, guys. Given that we are not buying any medications, it is definitely going to get a little bit tight. Um, that right there is something we can potentially cheese. Otherwise, is there's no point in running that facility. Let me show you guys something. Um, yep. So that's an automated dog stuff factory. I can get one tap there because it's all robots and I'm very, very low level. So what I'm suggesting we do here is right away, we have two skill points. Extra credits, searching containers, kind of useless for us. Extra ammo, we need that. Extra ammo will be very good for us. So I can't be too liberal spending credits. But I want to go down the isolation perk because we're not running any companions. So isolation is the way to go. If we make it past, I think, level 15 without dying, the chances are oh, we are sweet. Because after that, uh, the difficulty curve just drops off. But I will try and show you here is how to choose this facility because trying to fight your way through, it's just useless. There's only a chest in there, so of value. Everything else is just pointless. I would not recommend it at all. Although I don't know if this is a favorable gravity to do what I intend to do. Mm. Yeah, I don't think the, the gravity is favorable enough because you can just use those rocks there and jump right to the top. I mean, we might attempt anyway. Let's just see how we go. Okay, so what I recommend is we climb here and then we jump off from there. This is a very silly time of the day. It's like shadows are everywhere. Okay. Um, skills. Tech. Okay. Jetpack is a no-brainer, guys. Like it, it honestly, it's an absolute no-brainer. So we can either jump in that facility, get the key, and shoot straight up. But at my level, I'm only a one tapped. It's definitely not good for my health. So I'll try instead and climb the rocks see if the uh, starfield gods favor us so we quick save here oops okay almost 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 i can't see anything though <laughs> oh we might, we might just be able to choose this after all Okay, alright. 
There's also a magazine we can use. Oh, actually, no, I think the magazine is downstairs. I don't know why I'm quick saving. There's no point in me even quick saving because we're not reloading. Um, yeah, there's just no point. It's just a habit to quick save. So, what we want is the chest down there that's guarded by the dog. Oh, wow, I risked it, I, I risked it all for an incendiary combat knife. You gotta be kidding me, game. You have got to be kidding me. Wow. Just wow. Oh uh, boy. The one time when I need good good, good loot to drop, I'm getting nothing. I think all the luck went into my other character. Okay, anyways, let's check, check out another side. Alright, uh, let's see what we have here, ladies and gentlemen. So we have one facility, 870 meters. Anything else? Anything else? Alright, we got two. So the aim today is to do those two. That there looks like either a listen post or a... NPC facility. Although I have this sneaking suspicion, it may be something completely different. Nonetheless, let's go and check it out. I'd really like, want, like to test this uh, superior sentinel armor that we have, just to see how it goes. Um, let me know um, also if you want me to focus in, on exploration in this run or just purely combat. If the majority votes purely combat, then I'm just going to go from facility to facility and just absolutely face rolling until we get clapped, if we get clapped. Otherwise, we'll just do exploration like this where I'll just try and pass on any knowledge I may have about how I tackle things. So should you decide to ditch your overpowered characters and start fresh and... Actually, you know what? I'll do this challenge and I challenge you guys to do it with me. I challenge you to start a character, same... Um, same boundaries, same parameters, and we're journeying through this together. I think it will be much more fun that way. Let's just see what we have here. That could be a listening station, which is not ideal. Any chests here that we can open? Oh, trash. Uh, please don't be a radio tower. Give us something better. That is a radio tower, which is absolutely useless for us. Okay. Nonetheless. None Alright, let's just go back to that facility there. I really, really wish they added like lens uh, speeders or like better jetpacks that you can actually hold and just fly around. That's what the um, the skill should have been. Once you like max your jetpack, you should be able to do that kind of stuff. All right, so. We don't have anything landing, unfortunately. I wouldn't mind like a Claymore 3 at the moment. I'll absolutely take it. So Arsenal is not too bad. Um, we definitely have enough to deal with the boss of this facility. If we are lucky, we're going to get something good. If we're not, then we'll just keep going. I mean, this, this maelstrom that I have here, it's the best thing to happen to us until we get ourselves like a decent view of.
Now, fighting resources and stuff is going to be an absolute pain in the bum because we're not using vendors. And I really want to do the first research where we can unlock the scopes and the long barrels. That will be really, really useful for this run, given that this is a nomad run and we're living off the land. Alright. Once again, if you get favorable um, gravity, you can just go straight from the top and tackle it from there. Worst case scenario, this is going to be ecliptic. Best case scenario, Varun, but I've never seen Varun in this facility. Can you guys let me know if anyone's seen Varun in this facility before? I don't think they spawn here. It's either ecliptics or pirates, really. I usually take the stairs, but today we take the elevator. Pirates. Okay, so this is this is going to be interesting here. Seventy-four pirate flyer. So that's technically a boss. They got a higher ground and they have me unnumbered guys, so we have to think outside the box here. Otherwise, I'm dead meat. I'm banking that they get confident and they push me, just like this guy has here. Now, good thing here is we're gonna get some ammo. So this is better than Ecliptic because we get higher level bosses. They shouldn't be able to flank us. I believe there's only one way to get to where we are. If we get flanked, we're finished. There's no way I can repel them. Now, it's good to stand still and let the Sentinel do his job. So we can definitely trade a lot. Sentinel is the best uh, perk for trading damage. What is it, like 75% to give you half reduced damage, so... It's an awesome, awesome perk to have. Now, we're going to be small for ammo here. We can't just spray and pray. Ammo is not going to be a plenty for a while. Okay, I'll wait for this person here. Nice. Okay, the shots are skewing despite the long barrel, which is a little bit annoying. But the trading is good so far. So we can't yet this and just charge straight in there, just send it. Alright. So the boss is in front of us, one of the bosses. We still got a level 98 to go. I don't exactly have anything really fought him with here. Maelstrom, please tell me I had Maelstrom, yes, he did. Oh, no, 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 See, this is what I mean. This is what I mean, one lapse of concentration and I'm, I'm done. Okay, we're gonna pick up all the Maelstroms. Because that's giving us essentially ammo. Um... What a freaking waste. Membrane. Do, do, do we need membrane for anything? We don't. Get out of here. Space truck, space. Oh, I don't need any of that crap. That can go, that can go. Wait, all this crap can go really, realistically. We're only using like, yeah, it's only making me slower, so. An inflictor will be god sent right about now. I'll take even a gray one, honestly. I'll, I'll take any inflictor at this stage. Right. Let's see what our handiwork has given us here. Right. So the boss is up there. 
and he reckons we are easy money. I obviously beg to differ, but they're all entitled to their opinions, I suppose. Yep. Perfect, buddy. I was about to quick save the game just then instinctively. Okay. Did he drop down? Yeah, he did. At least something good. Okay, it's an upgrade, whatever, we'll take it. It's got chameleon and hacker. I suppose we'll take it. We're gonna heal here. We're not gonna be doing a low health run because that can prematurely end my uh, campaign here. Push in. That goes outside. Uh, there's usually plenty of meds here. Open the doors. Amp. I was yesterday years old when I figured out that you can open the doors and get a chest from here. So, another level 50 here with the potential to drop something good. It is insane how much damage the armor pissing rounds give you. This was a very, very good drop. A very good drop. And this is when I personally find Starfield to be the most fun when there's a little bit of challenge in there. Guys, I, I don't see this as a great challenge. I'm hoping for... Um, for survival to push me to, to my limits even more. Um enemies are nearby. The problem here right now Oh, there's a bit of a dilemma here. It's a bit of a dilemma, guys. And let me know in the comment section, should I stick with this one and run the Sentinel, which halves the damage, or go with the Advanced Bounty Hunter? I'll, I'll keep the spacesuit. But, um... Damn, that's a little bit sucky, isn't it? Master... Master, ch -ch master, where's our tears and I've been after? Ch -ch -ch. Oh, 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 oh. I think uh, watching Master of Puppets perform live would be like a dream come true for me. That would be absolutely amazing. Um, and I bet a lot of you guys. I have seen Metallica live and I'm so so jealous. I know Tim Clemenson probably seen him about three four times. Isn't the right team. <laughs> Get out of here. I feel like this is more accurate than the Star Shard, but. Yeah, this is a very accurate gun, but the sway, the sway. Thank you, sir. What do you have for us? Okay, better than nothing. We'll take it and get rid of it. We want to stay light. We want to be light on our feet. Now there should be a room that we opened up around here somewhere with a chest. Is it here? Could be here. Uh, it is not here. Is it here? It's not here. That was stupid and reckless. That was dumb and reckless. I did not anticipate there's gonna be damage in your room. Just gunning from very dumb, very reckless guys. Don't don't do what I did just there. We're gonna do a, a no death run. Doing what I did is 
is this... that hurt me more than they hurt him. Okay, at least we got the ammo back. Get rid of that. Up there. Oh my god, we're flying down the stairs. Alright. Third person gives you a better view, but I'm not used to playing third person in this game. Oh, there is a chest there. Nice. Uh, I always think that's um, downloaded. Not that it makes difference for us. Ah, oh, it's skip pack. It's not even better. But it will make us move around a lot quicker though. There we go, yeah, that's that's much faster mobility. Okay, we like that. We like that, we take it. Elemental Maelstorm. If only it was advanced, guys. If only if it was advanced. That would have been awesome. But what does it have? Bashing and Cinder Elemental. Nah, the one we have here is, is much better. Alright. Time for the real test here, guys. Time for the real test. I still think the Sentinel perk makes that ecliptic. Ooh, that is dangerous. I think the suit saved our life there. Oh, this is gonna get hairy. I think I played through May. If that pirate's running an advanced Beowulf, we're done. Or any Beowulf for that matter. We, we kinda cooked here. Alright, 3v1 and a level 98 and we are currently level 10 so it's got 88 levels on us guys, 88 levels. And we're not running any special weapons, we're just running a maelstone really, come on, push, push. Donkey, donkey, ponky. Pirate flare, but a donkey. Alright, wish me luck. I can get one tapped here quite easily. Why? Why you do this to me? Give it to me, baby. Uh huh, uh huh. Yeah, I'm happy for them to throw more grenades at me. I'm content with that. That means she's not shooting at me. That's. That's free. I'm lucky she's not running a beer wolf. If she is, it's not a very good one. He's trying a maelstone as well. We're very lucky to run out of ammo here, guys. And I really don't want to uh, waste that weapon. So I might switch to the mag sheet here. Yeah, this is my old crap weapon, but it's got limited ammo. So I'm kind of... Very limited how much I can use it. Donkey, donkey, donkey. If this boss heals, we're kind of stuffed. Awesome grenade throw there.
Punky, donkey, punky. Uh, let's see if we can uh, slip around. Yeah, it doesn't do much, does it? If that boss heals with toast, I'm sorry to tell you, fellas. But yeah, let's see, we're out of ammo. We're out of ammo. If she heals, that's this this playthrough done. Got a maelstrom. That's why we're still alive. That is why we are still alive. So don't get it twisted. I'll thank that. I'll thank that all day, every day. Please, I've put a lot of effort in this. Give me something good. It's an upgrade. Bye bye. It's an upgrade. It'll, it'll do the job. But we did kind of lose a lot of our um, ammo in the process. So, guys, you said no longer videos in 30 minutes. This one might go a little bit over. So I gotta be very fast here, I respect everyone's time and I'll try and do another one as fast as I can. Pretty sure I left a little meds up there though, um, just give me one quick second. So we're going to need, yeah we're going to need the meds. All the crappy weapons are dropped. There's no meds in there. In the kitchens here. Picked everything up from there. Got some ammo. I stuffed the meds. Let's just go. Let's just go. Alright, uh, let's see if we can find another facility here. Nothing inside, so we might have to go to the, the lighter side of the moon. So ideally... Okay, that deck can potentially uh, spawn a Claymore 3. It's one of those terminals. There is a way you can cheese that if you build an outpost. But we won't be able to build an outpost here because we do not have the perk to build outposts on extreme planets. And this is considered to be an extreme planet. But we are going to go there and check nonetheless. So it could be friendlies, it could be enemies. If it's friendlies, you're in luck. If it's enemies, Sorry, if it's enemies you're in luck, if it's friendlies then we can't do much. You still glitch it, but um, we just don't have the capability for it at the moment. So we got a terminal there, what else do we have? Anything else? There's another facility. I wonder what that is. On the horizon, we can go and check it out. What would be absolute godsend for us is like an advanced beer wolf or an inflictor. But inflictor is like taking the piss, right? It's asking a bit too much. <laughs> but a beer wolf is would, would be nice. We got like ten in my other run. Okay, what do we have? 
What do we have? Claim off me, please, please, please be. Wait, what? I can hear it. Oh my god, it's an autobahn. OMG. That's an autobahn. Please be an autobahn 3. If that's an autobahn 3, we are very, very wealthy men and women. Autobahn 2. This is not better than our ship. It just isn't. If this was an Autobahn 3, it would have been sweet. Yeah, I don't think we can um, we can steal this anyway. You have to do the the glitch to get it, but nonetheless. These locations just yeah, there's no way we there's no way they're gonna let us steal this. Even if I was to just uh, get rid of everyone, still no chance. Excuse me. Hello. Mm, some credits there. Wish we could just do this on neon. No. We won't name it. That's fine. Either way, let's just get out of here. Okay, 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 okay. We got that facility there, and then we'll call it a day. Hopefully end this on a legendary note, if you know what I mean. Do I have any amps? Any amps? Okay. This should make our traveling a lot more enjoyable. So we got decent ammo in this weapon to clear out one more facility. Hopefully it's a pirate facility. Well, ideally, hopefully, it's Varun, but Pirate is not bad. Really, right when we were about to end the video, you're giving me like these two facilities here. You couldn't do it at the start of the video, and we were just wandering aimlessly there. So apparently the one on the left is closer than the one on the right. I guess we're going to the one on the left. Just curious to see what it is, honestly. I'd like to know. Okay, so that day some sort of... Holy moly. That's a gigantic hole, isn't it? <laughs> That's what she said, Dimpo. Alright, what do we have here? What do we have here, ladies and gentlemen? That looks like a very, very interesting facility. That's definitely Garrison, whether friendly or not, remains to be seen. This here, however, is one of those robot operator facilities, isn't it? Has to be. Yeah. Yeah. Science outpost. Is there anything even, even worth taking inside the outpost? Like. Those robots will one tap me. 
Alright, let's check out the garrison and we'll call it a day. Yeah, it's just no point taking stupid risk if I know there's like no reward in there. Like, there's nothing to be gained. Not that I'm very risk averse, it's just stupid. Alright, alright, alright. Fingers crossed. This is something good. Please be hostile, please be hostile, please be hostile. Ah, it's just the, this dumbass is freaking training. Is there anything up top here to compensate me for indulging in this stupidity? They kind of seem preoccupied at the moment, so let them do their thing. Thank you very much. Oh, wow. That was... Oh, wow. Dagger. Just what I always wanted. Okay, we got some meds. It's all a They're still gone. Now if they gave me nicer stuff I would have gone and helped them because they didn't. They're on their own. Alright guys, I promised you one more facility, so we are going to go and do one more facility, I suppose. I do apologize, but this video is just going to drag on. I have not been able to find any facilities. We're sitting at the 40-minute mark so far. Um, Let's see. Oh, well, I haven't, I haven't aggroed, so I technically I shouldn't really... Yeah, we go, I can travel. Alright, 735 meters, and that is a pirate facility. That place has an OP weapon rack as well. So, I think it's time we went and paid it a visit. We don't exactly have a long range weapon, I mean this is medium range. Maybe we'll pick up an old earth sniper rifle. It will do it will do the job in the interim. Then there's another facility down that way. And that looks like an NPC facility. And that's perfectly fine. That is perfectly fine. Is this an abandoned hangar? Please let it be. No, nah, the game is not crapping itself. Which means it's not an abandoned hangar. Which means our job is a little bit tougher here. Not by much. Just a little bit tougher. So I don't want to aggro anyone on the outside. There's just no benefit to it. Um, the the elite there was too low of a level to matter. Oh, sorry to hurt your feelings, pirates. You all matter to me. Said no one ever. Okay. We'll try and sneak in. That is the name of the game here.
Okay. Let 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 the chameleon do its thing. All right. Wish me luck. This is gonna get proper hairy. Any meds here for us? No meds. Trauma pack. We'll take it. Mm, right, right, taking the antibiotics, we need that, safe, we don't have advanced, which is fine. Alright, I'll let the fun begin ladies and gentlemen. We have a bed that we can use to save, not save, sorry, um, replenish our health. So we don't have to use our meds here, at least we are okay from a medical standpoint. So I'm not worried how much damage I take here. We'll pick up all the maelstones for the ammo. Let me show you why I'm not worried. So what we're going to do essentially is take damage, sleep, sleep it off. We're not going to waste our meds. Ooh, we we'll try to sneak up on while I slept. I'm running sentinel, buddy. You ain't got nothing on me. I don't want a drum beat. I don't want a drum beat. What do we have here? Mannequin. No, thank you. Um, 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 um. Do we have a cryo mine? Probals. No, no cryo mine yet. Cryo mine are broken. They're the best. They just like. I hate wasting ammo unnecessarily. Not as much as I hate wasting meds, but ammo definitely. Yeah, that was a little bit too close for comfort. Disassembler, advanced lawgiver. Calibre Grendel. Expert magazine, we take it. I had no idea there was a magazine there. Uh, med pack, alright. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Profits, easy profits. As long as we end up net positive on med packs, it's a W. Let's just quickly drop down what we don't need. I've never really used that, so I just don't, don't need it. How much damage does it do? Whatever. Might as well take it. Okay, so. There's two ways to approach this. And quite literally, two ways. Two, so. Let's see what we can do. Be, we know there's going to be a level 98 here. There it is. It's just a question of what else is the game going to throw at us. It's a master lock. How many of them charging at us? Difficult to say. I have a feeling that boss will heal. Just a nagging sensation. We got another elite there. A level 50 unfortunately. Still has a chance to drop advanced weapons, but it's not guaranteed. Nonetheless. Yeah, this is going to hurt our ammo, guys. This is going to hurt our ammo a lot. Um... And that I'm not okay with. 
so we're just gonna have to um, take a slightly different approach. That's a good hiding spot, mate. Stay there. Yeah, ammo is going to be a little bit challenging here. Let's just go and reset the encounter. Just reset the encounter quickly. Almost there, we can level that up. Combat ballistics, we can go up. Shotguns, not yet. That's fine. 348 rounds and a dream. We can do this, guys. Have faith. Some big damage there. Not hitting me, so this looks like a good spot as any. I spoke too soon, it seems. That's the level 98 boss there. Yep, he healed. Bastard. I suppose you want him healing sooner rather than later. Doesn't help our cause though. Yep, stay there, stuck there. Right. How much health does this like I have? Yeah, I mean, if it took us that much to take down the level 50. Taking out that guy there is going to be a little bit challenging, guys. No, no, why do you? This is a potentially a futile endeavor. I mean, I hope not, but. Chances are that it is. It was the level 50 boss. Now of course we get something absolutely left field. Right, you keep that mate. Take that mouse storm. Alright. Where do we live? Maybe he didn't even heal or just did no damage to the guy. You know? It's also a very strong possibility we need to consider. You wanna peek? Bro, you're level 98 and you're right you're running scared from me come on what is this what is this level 10 play aggressively pushing is or 12 i think we're now level pushing level 98 on very hard difficulty and the ai is backing away that is insane that's absolutely insane I have a feeling he's going to drop a grenade launcher. I just have this itching feeling and that chest is going to give us something blue. Something useless. Maybe purple, but a bit useless.
All right, just gonna put in the work here. Get ready to work, 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 work. He's not really hitting us that hard, so... He's finding a maelstrom, it seems. So I can afford to be a bit brave. I'm not liking the fact that I'm just going through all this ammo, trying to fight this one person. Kind of rubs me the wrong way. But we're almost there, guys. Almost at the end of it. I can see the light at the end of the tunnel. Just bear with me. Okay, rest it up. Back down the rabbit hole we go. We've wasted a lot of ammo here. A lot of ammo. Not too happy about it. We're almost there. One last reload. That's GG, I believe. GG's. What do we have? Zombie. Please give us something good. There's like a combat knife. Ah, game. Game, game, game. That is absolutely trash. Absolutely trash. But it is what it is, ladies and gentlemen. You cannot win them all, certainly. Uh, we tried. We had a good run. You can go. Don't need you. Don't need you. Keep. Don't need you. Keep. Keep, keep, and keep. Yeah, not the greatest, uh, but some med packs. Med packs. We made some profit on med packs, I suppose. But I don't know if that was enough to justify the ammo expenditure, though. I don't don't think it was, guys. Do not think he was, but whatever. Okay, so we have, we can now get more ammo from stuff, which is good. It's great. Not too worried about that, because that's not an urban eagle in there. And it's got a weapon rack. Anyways, thank you for watching. I do apologize that the video took a lot longer than anticipated. But uh, we just couldn't find facilities for a while. Look, we gave it our all. It's a good start to the um, no, no Death Run series. Considering, you know, we were like level 9 or something. We are now level 13, I believe, 12. So we're making steps in the right direction. Next episode, we'll try and push some more facilities, see if we can get some better stuff and better ships. And uh, anyways, let me know what you want the challenge to be in the next video. Please don't forget. And I hope to catch you next one. Peace.